team, it's Autumn coming at you with a huge baby haul if you have not noticed from the title below. Um, if you are new to this channel, before I get started, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up if you enjoy any part of it. And also, if you're new to this channel and um, you want to see more content, um, make sure you hit that subscribe button um, and also hit that bell notification so you can get alerts anytime we post. We're trying to post every Saturday, Sunday, and Wednesday for you guys. Um, but let's get into the good stuff. So... If you don't know, if you are new to our channel, um, we have two twin girls and we also have a four-year-old named Aurora. Our twins are Azara and Amira. Um, I've done a ton of shopping for Aurora lately and she is stacked up. Already wore her clothes so there's no point in doing a video about that. When I get her some more clothes, I will make sure to do hers. Um, but I have done a ton of shopping for the twins for summer clothes. And honestly, I'm not really sure why I haven't been shopping for winter stuff. Maybe because there hasn't been great sales, but I kind of just jumped straight to summer. Um, so all the sizes are really big right now for them because they're still itty bitty. Um, but I figured in a couple months I'll be thankful that I got all these sales and all these cute clothes for them. So I'm going to start with the stuff I got from Oshkosh and Carter's only because there's a ton and that will take the longest. Um... And for those of you moms that don't know, Oshkosh is actually going out of business. So most of their store is 50% off or more. So I got a ton of cops from there. Um, and like I said, a lot of it is summer stuff. So they won't wear it for a while. But why not stack up now? Um, I also got a tip from another YouTube channel that you can put like their summer stuff in a bin. That way it's not taking up a huge amount of space so that's what I plan to do with all of this stuff so since I do have twins um, I know everyone assumes I buy double of everything but I actually don't I try to color coordinate more than anything but then the outfits that are super super cute that I just can't get enough then I will do the duplicates of so a lot of the stuff I only have single of um, but I will color coordinate them to make them look super cute. So a couple of the first things I picked up are um, either pants rompers or short rompers because even myself, I love rompers. Um, and I think it's super cute to have on babies. So my first one is this little denim short romper and it has a ton of hearts on it. And I only picked up one of these because I have a, actually a couple denim outfits so I figured I could coordinate that way. Um, and I may throw this with a colorful bow just to add some color to it, but super cute, and I love these little knots up here, super detailed, love it. Another outfit I picked up from Carter's was this super cute peach romper, yeah it is a romper, I thought maybe it wasn't for a second, but it is, it's connected, um, it's just like, has a slit right here, and a super cute bow in the front, this has like some type of flowers on it. But this is also from Carter's, so even if I wanted to coordinate these two together, I could do this type of bow with this outfit so my girls match. But super cute, super cute for the summer. This is a great color for the summer. So the next item I got is also from Carter's, and I actually got this one on clearance for $3.99, and it's a super cute little denim shirt. I love denim, especially on babies, so I figured I could throw this with some um, green leggings, or like olive green leggings. And that would be super cute. Or maybe some black and white polka dot leggings. I don't even own those, but I'm sure I could find them somewhere to put with this. So like I said, I'm totally into the rompers. So I actually picked up two other rompers. Here's another pant one with another type of flower. Super cute for the summer. And then I also picked up this black and white polka dot long sleeve one. Or long sleeve, oh my gosh. Pant one. It's not long sleeve. Um, but this one's super cute, so my idea when I bought this one would actually be that it's for the fall since it does have pants. May get a little too hot for the babies in the summertime, plus it is a six month so they probably won't fit it until the end of the summer anyways. So I figured I could um, have them wear this in the fall and just add a jean jacket over it. And that's a simple, cute little fall outfit, maybe some Vans or something like that. But I love it and I love the polka dots. Um... I also picked up this outfit for the summertime. It's another romper because I have issues. And it has little watermelons on it. And I also only got one of these because I figured this as well as this could be intertwined because they have the same peach color. So Carter's tends to do 50% off their new arrivals. So although these were not on clearance, they were still 50% off. Um, so they were, if I could look at it, around 20 bucks. So I got them for $10. So super cute, 
definitely worth it. All right, so I have about four more items that were from Carter's and Oshkosh. Um, the next two are pretty simple, but I figured I could really dress them up with some cute Converse or Vans and also just add a bow. A bow goes a long way with some little girls. So my first shirt I got says more donut, please. And I thought this would be super cute with some denim jeans, um, blue jeans, and then also some white vans and uh, possibly a white bow. And I actually did get two of these because Anthony honestly loves donuts. And I thought this would be super cute because, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I just thought it was cute and I thought of him. So I got two of these for the girls. And then I also got two of these because... Which it says, hello, my name is Princess, because both of our girls are princesses, honestly. They're perfect. I don't know if I'm biased, but I think they're perfect. So I thought this was super cute. Um, I have some super cute new shoes I got also, which I'll show you in a little bit. But I thought it would be super cute with this and some white jeans as well. So the last things I got from Carter's were on clearance. Um, they were $15.99 and then I believe they were an additional like 70% off so I got them for, I don't know, less than 8 bucks. Um, and that's these little vests. I actually got two of them. And they have little hoods as well. So, looks like that. Oops. And it also has some ears on it. Um, I figured this would be cute with um, a long black sleeve shirt and some jeans for the fall time. So obviously this is way too hot for the summertime, so I plan to wait um, a little bit. It says newborn, but it looks pretty big, so I think they'll be able to fit it in the fall time. So the next store I went to was TJ Maxx. Um, for anyone that is sleeping on TJ Maxx, you need to wake up and go there because they have some super cute clothes. And honestly, for reasonably good prices, uh, not too bad. Not super cheap, but not too bad. Um, I only picked up one outfit, but I get, did get two of them, one for each girl, just because I was absolutely in love with this outfit, and I honestly wanted it for myself. If it was my size, I would totally wear it, um, but I got this little cute romper. I told you, I have issues with rompers, um, but it has, like, some blue, pinkish red, and olive green flowers, and I got two of them. And I thought this would be super, super cute with a denim jacket um, also. And then I wanted to try and find some olive green sandals, and I thought that would be super cute. And then um, the last store I went to was Old Navy, and oh my gosh, Old Navy. They're going to take all my money. So to be completely honest, I never shopped at Old Navy. I think my mom used to take me there when I was maybe in elementary school and I got one or two things. But besides that, I would never went to Old Navy up until recently. Um, and honestly, I don't even know what encouraged me. It was flip-flops. It was their dollar flip-flops. So that's why I went in there. And I happened to go in the baby section, which honestly, I didn't even know they had like a newborn like baby section or anything like that. I thought it just started at like elementary um, sizes. But when I saw their baby section, I was like, Lord, pray for me because there is so much cute stuff. Honestly, better than Target, better than anything else. I love Old Navy. Um, and online shopping, too, they have so much more. So the first things I picked up are for the summertime. They're zero to three month, um, so my girls will fit perfect into them by the time the weather gets nice. Um, the first thing is this cute little two-piece. So it's like the little, you know, diaper-looking bottoms and that top and it has little daisies on it and then I didn't get two of these because I got this one to coordinate with which has like a little denim underneath and it just has like a little embroider print right there and it's plain so I'm gonna have my girls wear these together super cute the only thing about Old Navy is they don't really have sales they're not the cheapest um, but still super worth it in my opinion I love this, and a lot of moms shop at Target. I don't know what it is about Target. They're super overpriced to me um, for the items that they have. So the fact that I can get some unique pieces from Old Navy that a lot of moms don't shop at, it's pretty cool. I like it. Love these two outfits. So the next thing I picked up was this two-piece that actually came together, and they're supposed to be flowy rompers. This first one is yellow with white polka dots and it actually has real pockets like some adult things don't even have real pockets and like what is a baby gonna hold in there i don't know maybe a binky i don't know and then the second one has ice cream cones oh, 
Although they don't match, I think it'll still be cute to have my girls wear them at the same time because it's the same type of style. Probably throw them with some white flip flops and call it a day. One of the last clothing pieces I got from Old Navy was another romper. But it's actually a short romper and also tank style. It's white and uh, pink stripes and it has like super cute buttons on the front. And this one has fake pockets, but it's still super cute. I only got one of these. Um, the only reason I got one of them was because they did not have another one in this exact size. If they did, I would have picked up another one because this is a must-have, in my opinion. And honestly, I will probably throw this one with some brown sandals because it has the brown details on the buttons. And a lot of the other outfits I was pairing with white sandals, so I think brown would be a super cute twist. So the last thing I picked up from Old Navy was actually a bathing suit. And I have bought so many bathing suits for our girls that I don't even think they're going to swim that much. <laughs> like, they're going to have to change bathing suits twice in, like, one day because I have so many. So this one was a must-have to me. I don't know why, but it is so stinking cute. And it has ruffles all around it, even on the back. And our girls will only be around five or six months at that time. And this is a three to six month. I just figured they would look so cute. Like, they won't even be able to walk. So, I also picked up a bathing suit from Carter's. I thought this one was from Old Navy as well, but as I'm looking at it, it was from Carter's. Um, it was also a must-have, and I will probably have one of my girls wear this one, and then the other girl wear the blue one at the same time, because they're kind of the same type of style. Um, this one is pink, and it also has a flamingo on it, and it is striped. Super cute, and I think they would look adorable with little, like, baby sun hats, too. So, I'll probably try and pick some of those up as well. While I'm on the Old Navy kick, I want to go ahead and show you guys a ton of sandals and shoes I got. I don't know why I got so many shoes and sandals for babies that are only going to be like five or six months in the summertime, but I did because I just couldn't resist. They're super cute. Um, the first two sandals I picked up, even Anthony was like, must-haves. Um, so I knew if he said they were cute and I had to get them, then I definitely had to get them. So that's these little gladiator type sandals I think they're called gladiators I'm almost certain this one is like a light pink um, so even go super cute with that striped romper I showed you and then I also grabbed a white pair that are like super cute and this will go with anything like literally anything so those were the only sandals I picked up I thought I picked up more but the other ones tend to be more tennis shoe like um, the other shoes I picked up are these little shoes. I'm not really sure what you would call these, but they're like a peach salmon color. Super cute. I think even if uh, the babies wore, I don't know, some white shorts and a denim shirt, that would be a cute little color to add in. And I got two of them, of course, because they were super cute. And they were also on clearance for $4.99, so I couldn't couldn't miss that. Another shoe I picked up that was also on clearance on um, this one was $6.99 and these are actually size 6 so they will not fit these for a while probably like two years but they were super cute to me so I had to pick them up and that is these little pink shoes. I don't know if you can tell from the video but they are shiny and super cute. Since they were on clearance I had to get them. And then I also picked up Two other shoes um, that were not on clearance, but I believe they were 30% off at Old Navy. Um, the first pair are these little white um, little sneaks. I'm not really sure what you would call these either. But they have little flowers embroidered in them that are super cute. And it's like super soft. They're like not even a shoe. There's like nothing to it. <laughs> and then I also went ahead and got the same thing, same style, but they're pink. No embroider, but still super cute, and I got one of these as well. So like I said, Oshkosh is going out of business, so I got a ton of stuff from there um, that was mixed with the Carter stuff that I showed you. And if you don't know, they are also partnered um, with Crazy 8. I'm not really sure if Crazy 8 is in every state, but they do have them here in Michigan. We have one at our mall close to us, and I'm so, so sad that they are going out of business as well because I guess they are owned uh, by the same uh, corporation, I guess you could say. Um, so they had their store 50% off, so I did pick up a couple things from there. Um, the first thing is this little um, bomber. It's light pink and like 
Oh my god. <laughs> I can't even get over that they make this for a little girl. And this is a size 6 to 12 month. Um, so they won't fit it for a while, like I said, probably next fall or winter. But I did pick up two of them because they were must-haves. And honestly, it's really hard to find bombers um, at stores. So I thought maybe I should get it while um, I did see it in the store. And I got it on sale. So it worked out. And then also at the same store, um, because they had 50% off, they also had leather jackets. Um, also 6 to 12 months I did pick up, but they are a like creamish color. And I believe they are real pockets. Insane. And I also picked up two because they were must-haves. And this, honestly, I really, really, really want to find black jeans, some black shoes, maybe some black high-top Converse, and I want to find a cheetah scarf that, like, obviously for a baby, but uh, two cheetah scarves uh, that will fit babies. That way they can wear that whole fit. It'll be super cute. I don't own black jeans yet for them or those shoes or that scarf, but I'm determined to find it by the next fall. Alright guys, so that was all of the clothes that I picked up. I do have a couple things to show you um, that I ordered online that were super cute. Um, I actually got them from Etsy. I don't remember what the Etsy um, store was called or the uh, person selling it. I could look it up. If anyone was interested, I will put the link below. Um, but I have an obsession with bows. Like, the baby's heads are still really small and they barely fit bows. And I honestly have so many. Like, I have this whole bin full of bows like that is crazy um but i did order some cute ones that fit now that's the reason i ordered some more and these are actually they call it a grab bag so you don't even pick what they look like they surprise you and this one is their spring collection so these are the bows i picked up super super cute this top one is like my absolute favorite and then I also got another pack that are these. So super cute um, spring colors like the blue and the purple. I figured that would be great for Easter. Um, and they actually fit their heads and they are like super stretchy nylon. So I definitely recommend. I'm going to put the link below to that Etsy account as well. Um, and this is not a promotion. I just really like her bows. Alright guys, so that's all of the pickups I have for you today. Make sure if you did enjoy this video and you would like to see more baby hauls, give it a huge thumbs up. I'm always shopping for the babies, so I would be more than happy to do more videos like this. I honestly really enjoy it. I love baby clothes, love shopping for my girls, um, so I'd be more than happy to make more of these. If you did enjoy it, make sure you leave some comments below if there are certain stores you'd like me to shop at or certain things you'd like me to um, do reviews on. I can also go ahead and do that also for Anthony as well if there's any Think for some guys leave some comments below on things you want to see and make sure you subscribe to our family so until our next video guys a team go